today's My Future, My Choice report, some South Florida high school students putting the bite on mosquitoes with a new invention that disrupts the bloodsuckers' breeding habits. Local 10's Nikki Mohan explains how it works. Meet the minds of the Invent team at Northeast High School in Oakland Park. They are heading to MIT this summer after winning a $10,000 grant. Their invention, a mosquito disruptor. Because Zika, mosquito-borne diseases affect millions of people and unfortunately millions of people die. We decided that we will do something because something can be done. So we decided to create our invention to disrupt the breeding of mosquitoes. Yes. This Tupperware container with a motor inside is just one version. They have another version that will be solar powered. You can see the full impact on the water when they turn off the lights. They spent a year making their concept a reality. So you guys don't forget you're talking to professionals at MIT. Their teacher, Clara Marbor, won this grant when she was a student at Northeast High School. This latest win makes them the only high school in the U.S. to get this honor twice. Eureka Fest at MIT is a wonderful experience and it's something that's going to be great for them as young engineers, inventors and scientists in the future. Now they're working on a patent to take this invention worldwide. You could use it to lower the rates of malaria or dengue fever, any anything that is spread from these type of mosquitoes. And you just have such an incredible opportunity, you and your team, to get to go up there and present an idea that you created and you spent all this time and effort to put into it. It's just like, wow. With this $10,000 grant, the students are hoping to lay the groundwork for teams to come. They head to Boston June 19th. In Oakland Park, Nikki Mohan, Local 10 News.